pinch this ass. Welcome back to Chin Chap. Good, Chaps. Good lord. <laughs> that was a whole lot of gas <laughs> expunged in a very short period. I told you it's coming out both ends. It's all that schwarm. You did say that. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Billy, are you going to have to poop before you leave? Yeah, I already did. Oh. That's why I went to the bathroom. Oh, okay. And it wasn't enough. There's always more, Taylor. More poop. More poop. More poop. That's one thing that you'll... Oh my god! <laughs> oh, Jesus! <laughs> There's one thing what now? No. Um, <laughs> that's one thing that will always be in your Oh my god. <laughs> that's one thing what now? <laughs> that's one thing that'll always be in your life. The last thing you'll do is poop yourself. <laughs> yeah, I guess so, uh very true. Kept getting distracted. <laughs> More poop. <laughs> yeah, there's no no treasures in here, so fuck this place. Why would I go through the graveyard when I can go around it? On the path. Of righteousness. I'm sure there was nothing that made that sound. It's all good. Oh, I think it was a crow. I yeah. Think. It was a crow. All right, we, we can't get in. Well, I guess we might as well just go home. Negative. Nothing yet. They sure do have this place locked up tight. I see. I can think of one reason they want to do so. Oh, she's here. That's for sure. I'll find a way. Condor one. Who just put? 400 pesos in a box. I don't know. Like a full box. Yeah, right. So, yep, that's where that goes. Just gonna leave it there. I am offended, angry, and racist. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> Well, admitting you have a problem is the first step. Traitors, twins, I should not be allowed to rest in peace and joy in the evil cult. What would say when anyone think of the children? Destroy the tombstones. Emblems. Okay, let me go back. Let me go find him. Also, um... Uh, tre treasures, treasures. This one. Yeah, you can't put stones in that one. No, okay. No. Nope. Yeah, it's just, that's just one of those ones you get and you sell. Bummer, dude. Going back to def <laughs> defile some tombstones. Everyone's favorite thing to do. <laughs> Alright, where's the tombstone? It's the twins. Is it this one? Because there's two? No, you it's pretty obvious once you see it. Or maybe it is, maybe it is. I don't know. I don't know. Could be obvious, could not be obvious. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I've never played this game before. I haven't. I wonder if it's these ones. For the sake of, of, of this part, <laughs> I haven't played this game before. Or is it that one? What does it say to do the headstones? Right, to uh, yeah, file them? Something like, yeah. <gasps> okay. Okay. That's yeah. what he said. It is what he said. I'm going to go rush back and talk to my grandma. Grandma! <laughs> grandma, I defiled some tombstones. <laughs> grandma, I did the tombstones for you. I defiled them. Just like you asked. What? 
You said. Why would you do that? You said to file them. I meant to file them. <laughs> oh. Oh my. Do you know how much money I spent on those fucking ads? A deal well struck, stranger. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, let me, let me, let me, let me repair that. Uh, what about my That's eyes? actually, like, more brutal than, like, he's been stabbing people with a really dull knife. <laughs> yeah. It's actually um, pretty fucked up. Uh, two extra bullets or faster reload? Faster reload. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> fuck you, Grandma. Go fix those gravestones that you ruined. Cause you can't read my instructions! Get out of my dad! <laughs> Billy, are you ready? To pay for some headstones? <laughs> ready? Ready doesn't even fucking describe it! Because no! I don't want to! <laughs> I'm very against it! <laughs> I couldn't really remember if I finished off what I hey, did over here. Hey, you got the elegant headdress. Okay, yeah, I'm good. <gasps> oh my god. Why do they always spill paint where it's where I can climb? That's weird. Who knows? Flash grenade. Flash grenade. Okay, back down. Okay, back down. Yeah! <laughs> no! No. Lulu, lu, lu, I got some apples. Lulu, lu, lu, you got some too. Oh, there's a typewriter. There's a thing there. Here's a map. Let me look at the map. Pestafro, Esta, outside of Wanan. Cave. Key, key, key and cave. Okay. Blake, let's hope for no more surprises. <laughs> well, you shouldn't have said anything. Why would you say that, Leon? How stupid of you. So <laughs> for no more surprises. <laughs> and yet he picks up the fucking picture of uh Doesn't say anything. Ashley. It's just like mm. she look cuter in the photos that I have. <laughs> she look you look cuter in my mind, I guess. I don't know. Mm. Do I really want to go down there? Maybe I can find Save a girlfriend me. now. I wonder if she'll be my like girlfriend. That's what he's thinking. <laughs> I'm 16. It's legal here. <laughs> it's legal here. <laughs> we, just, we just can't get across the borders yet. Anyone here? I'm not going that way. I don't think it would be legal there. Why the fuck would it be legal there? Why not? In this, like, backwoods-ass place? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm almost certain it's legal. Hey. I saw, I saw a funny video earlier today of somebody, like, <laughs> superimposed Borat in, in Resident Evil 4. <laughs> and it's just him going through, like, the, the scene that he normally does in the movie, but he's just, like... <laughs> What does he say? Like, this is my grandma. She's the oldest lady in Kusek. She is 43 years old. <laughs> oh! Is he alive still? Oh, fuck, dude. No, never mind. No. That might have been another dude. Because, like, you could see his body. Oh, yeah. Half his body there. Stand in front of each other. Yeah, please. <laughs> Oh, sorry, I totally missed that one. Oh, oh shit! <laughs> ah! Well, you tried to parry. Okay, uh, uh, oh, hold on. Oh, my fucking back. <laughs> Bitch. Oh, you broke his neck. <laughs> it must have slipped, yeah. Yeah, my foot slipped. Yeah, this isn't a good time to be dropping jokes, Leon. That'll be good. You're gonna let it ride? I'm gonna let it ride. Huh? Okay. Go well, if anything, this could be a learning experience. Who knows? That's that's how I like to treat it. Okay, I just like to do a get a 
do some learning. Uh oh. The snake kills you. <laughs> oh, no, that does. <laughs> the sickle. <laughs> All right, let me, uh, let me try that again. I waste too many, too many shots. No, it was, it was, it was bad etiquette. Did I? Okay, that is still open. We're done. Yep. Yipper. Yipperuno. Well, there's your second viper that you could sell if you so choose, or you don't have to sell it. You can use them to heal if you want. Ah, oh, my lip. Just uh, hold on, sir. Just I'm burping up my blood. Oh, hold on. Okay, that's good. <laughs> I like that shit. I think that's cool. Oh. Uh oh. 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 Half of him is. You're on fire, sir. You're on fire. Oh, it went out. It would have been great if he just burned. Yeah. <laughs> he just clocks his head into the wall. <laughs> Ow! God! My ear! My lip! Oh no, he did. Okay, cool. Sometimes they twitch. Oh, you got the viper too somehow. <laughs> I think you might have accidentally shot the box and then blew yep. it up. <laughs> That's that must have been what happened. All right. I hope no man comes up to me again. <laughs> Ow! Fuck! There's a piece of shit. Fuck! Oh! Oh, well, you cut his arm off for a second there. Ooh, another kitchen knife. That's good. I mean, the kitchen knife suck, but it's better to have a knife than not have one at all. That's true. I've just come to do a business deal. <laughs> yeah, and that's why I'm in a pinstripe. Where's the Don at? Well, Reba. Eat my asshole. <laughs> no, <laughs> thank you, sir. Yeah, I like the way that guy died. Cool. These fucking people. Damn you people. Go back to your shanties. Wow. Yeah. You're good? <laughs> yeah, you're good. Oh my God. You're good. Everything, everything's fine. I like it when you can bisect them and then you just see like the little tendrils. I think that's fun. <laughs> you have a weird definition of fun, Taylor. Oh, just in like. I don't know. I like the like, attention well, to detail. Well, yeah, it's fun. Like they just—they didn't have to do that. They—they could have just let them like get bisected and then that's it. It's true. But they're like, no, they're creepy, crawly, like goopy, in, infected Gooten. parasite people. Yeah. Yeah, Capcom's been fucking killing it. The only one I don't really care for was three. Yeah, I think a lot of people felt that way because it, they it felt like they kind of phoned it in on that one a little bit. <laughs> My luck. <laughs> yeah, like the way you felt. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, three. Well, three was like um, I think they could have done something different with it. Like I think it would have been more interesting if maybe they like opened it up more, mm -hmm. where like. Um, you know, the, the Resident Evil 2 was definitely more of, like, you know, kind of a one... Like, a relatively one-to-one, -one like, re recreation of the original. I never played Resident Evil 2, but I think, like, you know, it, it was it kind of was in the same spirit. But, like... Yeah, it was. I think for Resident Evil 3, what would have been more interesting is if they had done, like... Um, not, like, necessarily, like, an open world, but maybe something along the lines of, like, Metro Exodus, where it's, like, this larger, open, like, kind of area where you can... Um, no! Go back. You can't even get... Uh, that one I don't think you can get right now anyway. Yeah. There are See, some paces back there. Um, it's hanging there. You shoot it and then you pick it up later. I'm going to get these pesos first. Pesados. Pesados. Yeah, I think like with Resident Evil 3, like if they had done it to where it was like a pseudo open world type of thing and you're like kind of... Um, 
go back to the other side. Yeah. I was just seeing if I could see it from that side. Yeah. Um, yeah, they did like a pseudo open world type thing where you, like you can like pick your own like path through the city to get to the objectives and stuff. I think that would have been more interesting instead of it being just like another like kind of linear sort of yeah, affair. True. Right? You know, I think that would have been cool. Um, again, kind of like a Metro Exodus. Yeah, you get it later. Um, you know, where like Metro Exodus isn't quite open world, but yeah, it's but not still linear, but not linear. Yeah. So like I, th I think that would have been uh, an interesting way to to take it, especially considering like you're kind of in this crisis mode of like you're in a city full of zombies and shit's like going crazy, you know? She's going fucking crazy. Yeah, I just I think that would have been more interesting, like kind of in hindsight. But yeah, then they kind of like just pigeonhole it again. It's more of like a, a, a linear <laughs> thing again, which it's fine. It's fine. Yeah, but yeah. I, it, I, I'm there with you. That I think that was probably the weakest of the remakes so like, far. The other ones, you could say that was a good game. Yeah. With that one, you have to say it was fine. Yeah, it was fine. Like it was competent, but yeah, you know, it was fine. It like took out most of the game. Yeah. That was there, and that's an already short game. Yeah. yeah Resident Evil Three was released, I think, like a year after two or something. Like they didn't really do a whole lot of new shit in the. Good luck finding someone big enough to use this thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think I will soon. But this this one they like obviously took their time and like did a really good job with it. Yeah. You can destroy those blue medallions. The area is polluted. I was like, I can't bear it. Why is this guy so against these blue medallions? I always took it in the original that like he was the one that put them there. Yeah. But in this one, it seems like. It's framed more like the cult people put them here. But I don't know. I don't know. Any more doggos? I don't know. I don't think so. Oh, no, there's one. You lied to me, Tim. Well, I didn't see it. Oh. <laughs> I think they should have redesigned the dogs. Yeah. I don't really like too them. floofy. Well, no, they're just like the the big gaping mouths. Like they look goofy to me. But I don't know. Maybe maybe when people play tested it, they thought it was terrifying looking. But I think I think if they were more like just regular like looking wolves, I think it'd be scarier. Because I yeah. always thought they were scary in the original game. But in this one, I th I just think they look kind of too cartoonish. But that's yes, just definitely that's just my opinion. I think if you check the your map, you should see the blue medallions. Oh yeah, they're right there. If you want them, you don't have to get them. Oh, and there's a treasure hanging there somewhere. Oh, there it is. I think I saw the blue medallion up there too. Did yep. you see it? Yeah, there it is. Yeah, dude. Nice. Nice. Oh, nice. Oh, oh, there's some handgun ammo behind you. Here we go. Where's it? All right, cool. I missed that. I don't know. All right, blue medulians. But you did. You did miss it. You blue medulians. We'll see any more blue medulians. Yeah. Well, you have the treasure map. They would show it. We do, do they? Yeah. Yeah, that shows them on the treasure map because he bought it. So yeah, oh. if you go up, like go up, for example, like on the map. See right there? Like there's a blue medallion oh, thing. Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Blue Medulians. Yes, sir. Time to go to the shooting range. Gonna shoot me up some people. Gonna go down to the shooting range. Gonna shoot up a bunch of people. That's not a good song. <laughs> Don't like that song. Especially with how, uh, how the world is. <laughs> I know. That's what I mean. Oh, yeah, right there. Ooh. Uh, yep, okay. Now you get that key later. Now it's up to you for this episode if you want to do the shooting range. <laughs> shooting range, going to scoop, scoop, boom, boom, boom. We've got uh, like five more minutes, maybe. It's up to you what you want to do. I would maybe skip it for now, but that's just me. Because the shooting range is annoying as fuck in this game, and what you get for it is not really that good, but.
it's still worth doing. You get like little charms that you attach to your case, and they give you like little like boosts or perks or whatever. But like most of them are not super great. <laughs> Some of them are good though. Man, they're really skipping out on the on the pitas, huh? Yeah, not many pedos. treasure chest there. Maybe there's some pedos in there. <gasps> pedos? No. Hexagon. Boring. Piece. Can I do anything with that? Probably not. No, since it's, it's, it's in a little bit. It's um, it's something that, like a puzzle piece you need to unlock. Something for like a treasure. Mm -hmm. An optional treasure. There's more down. Yeah, go down there. There's yeah. nothing there. You can't go anywhere from there. Oh, okay. I was going to Saving, but if I can just go down and then come back up. Yeah, you can go down and come back up. Gotta get down to get back up. Shut it out. The, uh, well, yeah, like I was saying, the shooting range is really annoying in this game. Yeah. Like, I don't know. They could have. I'm not even really saying they should have changed anything with it. It's just really fucking hard. <laughs> I can't get this one. Yeah, you need another small key. <clears throat> It's just really difficult, Billy. I'm Why doesn't you. he sell small keys? <laughs> what doesn't make any sense is that he uses it and then it just disappears from his inventory. It's like you could just keep it. Yeah. Like Especially since only... it all seems to be the same small yeah, key. Yeah, it's all the same small keys. Why do you like dispose of it after you use it? Is this where I can shoot into the water and then the snake? No, no, no. It's snake salamander? Mm, nope. Nope. But they did keep that in the game, which is nice. Oh, good. Why did somebody spell paint again here? What the fuck? Someone, someone probably jizzed on it. Did you save your game? Not yet. Oh, okay. That's what I was going to do, but then you're like, oh, there's nowhere to go down. That's not what I said. You're like, there's nowhere to go after there is you go down. There's nowhere to go. You are stuck here. You must shoot. <laughs> hey, you can use the next three minutes as a test. Scouting mission. As a scouting mission, yeah. Hello? Romain. Is that where I scoot? What's, uh, what's this guy doing? Now that he's looking at us, we can now dump this body. Yeah, we just had to <laughs> wait. That's a headless man. I wonder who that was. Was he headless? Is he headless? Yeah, yeah he looks like he is. Yeah. <clears throat> Why even bother? Why? Holy oh, shit, fucking minions. Snake. Salamander. There's other things you can look at if you want. If you look, uh, yeah, where it's, like, you can see it's, like, pointing into it. Like it's a house. It's a shitty For boats. Boat it's a shitty boathouse. It's a boathouse. It's like a roadhouse. Um, it's telling you where to look. Is it? Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, I see. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> that's comically huge. <laughs> that's a huge that's fucking in, That's insanely huge. <laughs> I mean, the original was huge, too, but it's just funny to, like, see it from that distance, because they didn't have it in the original game. Yeah. Like that. It's fucking big. Yeah, it's enormous. It's a Dixie Normus, as we like to say. I don't know who says that. Someone. Someone probably said that at <laughs> least once. That was in Austin Powers. <laughs> you remember in Goldmember at the beginning when uh, they're doing the mock Austin Powers movie and it's Tom Cruise? And then uh, I think the, the female love interest was Gwyneth Paltrow. And she comes up and she's like, Hi, my name is Dixie Normus. <laughs> I miss those names. All those names are just well because like you know like that that was like a, a funny thing kind of if you really think about it like yeah. in some of the the James Bond movies is like the pussy galore pussy galore Christmas Jones <laughs> pussy galore is the most notorious one yeah that sure. one's just super on the nose yeah yeah um, even the fact that it was called an octopus is kind of funny don't you think like that was the name of the movie. Octopussy. Uh, fucking craft. 
I'll mix it with this guy. Now I can drink it. Or I could wait. No, I'll drink okay. it. Okay. Well, I'll Dude, fuck you. Don't tell me how to play my kitchen game. <laughs> Alright, Billy, are you ready to do this again next time you play this game? Yeah, I do. <laughs> and then I can make a different choice. I mean, unless, unless you want to go save it again real quick. It's right at the end of the episode. <laughs> what do we got here? Shotgun. We'll, we'll get you next time. We'll get some more action in next time. We had to get the Star Fox in today for Alex because she's been pestering us nonstop. Nonstop. For the past Every time I see her, months. she doesn't even say, Hi, Billy, I love you. She says, Where's Star Fox? <laughs> it's like, you can play this game if you want, Alex. She if could. you have a copy of it, just play it your goddamn self. I don't think she has a GameCube. Well, go to DK Oldies. Buy a refurbished one, boot it up, it won't work. <laughs> get mad. Get mad. Beat it up. Ask for a refund. They won't give it to you. Actually, you could beat up a GameCube pretty good. Those things were like built like fucking tanks. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Remember that one time on fucking X-Play they did it? They fucking yeah. like busted all of them? And, like, the GameCube survived. Like, it still worked. You good? Welcome. They dropped oh, it good. from, like, ten feet up in the air on the concrete, and it still worked. Yeah, that was the only... And they hit it with a sledgehammer, yeah. and I can't remember what else they did, but... I remember the PlayStation It was a, lasted for a little bit. The no. Xbox immediately broke. No, no, was, that was the opposite. The X, No, the PlayStation broke immediately. Oh, yes, yes. And then the Xbox, which was pretty heavy, they I think after the 10-foot drop, it broke. Yeah. Because the front face plate came off or something. I want to watch that video now. Next time at Chinstrap Chaps, we do it. We watch that video. Billy shit his pants. No, that was not me this time. Oh, it was me. 